Hello everyone, it's me, Jace Kabeen, and welcome to Miss Eyesore. It's an indie horror game that I got off of Itch.io. It was actually made for the Ludum Dare 42 game jam, which is based on not enough space, so I guess claustrophobia has a lot to play with this game jam. And, um, I, I don't know what it's about, but I know the character model looks awesome. Look at, look at Miss Eyesore. That's brutal. Okay, how to play. Let's see how to play. Okay, how to play. Keep as many generators running as possible. You need them to keep the lights on. For each generator that breaks, your power level will decrease even faster. If your power level reaches zero, the lights will turn off. No lights means the monster can get you. So the monster can only get you when it's dark? Okay. In the game, there will be a map of the bunker complex. On the map, the different generators are listed in their corresponding number, one through nine. If the generator on the map starts blinking, then it's broken and needs repairing. If the red lamp turns static, it's broken and beyond repair. Ah. Quickly close the door leading to that generator. If you don't, Miss Isol will come after you. You will need to close any door leading to the generator so it's unreachable. Uh, okay. Remember that closing doors means losing the generators for good, but also that you stay alive. You can avoid losing them, close the doors. Okay, so if you lose a generator, like you don't get to it in time, uh, then, or if it breaks beyond repairing, then you gotta close the door to that generator. Or you die. If the generator is broken, it also means the room will go dark, the lights will, and the ceiling will turn off, and the generator will stop making noises. If this happens, quickly get out and close the door. The generator is beyond repair, and the monster will get to the d dark room soon. Uh, walk around with the last, sprint holding shift, interact with objects by clicking on them, and a prompt will appear, blah, blah, blah. Okay, cool! Okay, so, basically, if you see darkness in a room, close the doors. <laughs> and, uh, okay, we got this. We totally got this. I, I tried playing this game already once, not playing it, but I jumped in, and it drops frames on my face cam, so I apologize ahead of time if I'm dropping frames. It's just, it's, it's, it's tough, um, tough on my PC. Uh, hello, um, is anybody there? I'm the foreman of this bunker and in charge of maintaining it. We intercepted your distress call and are currently trying to break in to get you out. It seems to have, uh, seems to have gone haywire and all the doors leading to the lock are in are locked shut. We will need to get in. Blah, we will get it open soon, but you will have to wait a little while. It seems that the connection to the mains have gone out, so make sure that you don't run out of power. And do try to keep as many generators as possible running, or else power will run out faster and store capacity won't be enough to keep the lights on. Eh, uh, it's very, very important that you keep the lights on, but if for some reason the lights go out in one of the rooms containing a generator, which will happen if the generator breaks, then you must close the door. This is of utmost importance. Outmost importance. But we will get you out, but make sure to keep the lights on and close all doors to dark rooms. The map board on the main room wall will show what generator is broken. Oh, and the door system is malfunctioning, so if you close any, if you close the door, you might not get it open. Stay calm, sir, but not too calm, of course. We are, the transmission's cut out, okay. Uh, okay, that's the script. Okay, cool, so I just need to keep an eye on the generators. Uh, so I am here. Uh, okay, I see. So what's back here? That's, that must be the exit, that's the way out, okay. Cool, all right, so straight back this way, generator in this room. Got it. So, click and hold. Okay, that's not too bad. So you just gotta stay on top of the generators and keep them running. That's not bad at all. I'm assuming the more the, okay, so, uh, this, this way? And down this way? Got, okay, I see. Uh, click and hold to repair. Okay, generator's working now. Now we get back. Okay, so it's gonna, it's gonna get intense. They're gonna stack up on me a lot. Um, back this way again. This room? You just gotta hold on to the, Okay. Okay. Easy peasy. Just gotta keep and make sure everything's all okay. Uh, all the way to the left and all the way down. Alright, I can do that. I can do that. This is really cool. I like this. This is really good atmosphere. There's not too much music. Okay. Oh. Is, is it dark in there? Did that count as it being dark? I don't, I don't know. I can't tell. It is pretty dark. Uh, str left and just, just left. Okay. Left and then straight down. Click and hold to repair. I'm, I'm clicking and holding. Do you have to get this one down first? Okay. Alright. I did it. It's not dark. Oh, oh, oh! Game over. Okay. The monster got you. This game was created 72 hours for the blah, 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 blah. Okay. Yay, let's repair it. Cool. Hope I don't lose the generator. Oh no! 
What the crap, man? How'd that happen? You died because you didn't close the door to Generator 3 on time. Remember to close all the doors and do to dark rooms. Okay. At least it tells you why you died. Let's get it. Let's get it. <gasps> Did I run out of power? I think I ran out of power. You died because you ran out of power. Whoa. Okay. But it says it's repaired. Why is it blinking? I'm confused. Hold the repair. I don't- I don't understand! I don't understand! Whoa! I don't know what happened. So when they go static, when they're blinking, that's when you have to check them. When they're solid, that's what he means by static, solid. So when it's a solid light, then you gotta close the door off. Five seconds. Three seconds. No way. Did I win? <gasps> Oh my god. Uh, none of them are blinking. They're all out and they're all closed off. So I can't go to the right. I can't go to the far left and I can't go to the bottom right. So I only have one, two, three generators to work off of. That really blows. And that generator's going down now too. So that power is just going to keep going out. Dude, that sucks. Because once you block off that mid room, that really, it really kind of screws you. There's no way. I'm not I'm not going to get this in time. I have way too little power. Yeah, I'm losing the generator. I'm Lose all the generators on that side. All right, so we learned we just got to keep an eye on generator power and keep an eye on like how what we have on and how, like, how many we have on. If it's 99% that we have one down, if it's 88% we have two down and etc cetera, etc. Cetera. We gotta try to prioritize as much as we can and get to them as quickly as possible. So right now we're at 88. Okay, we want to keep it above 88 if possible. At like at all times, keep it above 88. Whew, dude, this is hard. This is a lot harder than it looks. This is a way hard game. Like this is this is going in the challenge pocket. This is definitely going in the challenge playlist. Holy crap. Okay, that's done. 99. We're still at 99. 88. Okay, let's see which one it is. Uh, bottom right again, okay. Uh, I know I say bottom right, but it's more to remind myself. <laughs> like you guys can tell what's going on. You guys can see the screen, and that's the beauty of Let's Plays, is you guys can see what's going on. All right, just go straight down. Shut this off. So so you definitely want to prioritize the mid rooms if you have multiples. So I'm going to do that. If, if, there's, a, if there's multiple uh, generators out and you don't know which one came first, then you're going to want to repair a mid room before you repair an end room. Because if you repair a mid room first or last, then there's a chance of that mid room going out, and then you're, you're closed off to all the generators out that the branch out beyond that point, which is no bueno. This is not good. So okay, right there again, 88. It's fine. It's fine. 99. Okay, keep an eye out for 88, and keep an eye out on the thingy. Ha. Okay, 88. Still at 88. That's good. All right, cool. We want to keep it at 88, at like the minimum, if at all possible. Okay, top right, still 88. Let's get this one real quick. So the the rooms only go out when you don't get them in time. Like that, that's it. They don't just randomly go out on you. If you if you fail to repair a generator on time, it'll go completely out, which will happen if you get generators like in the dead end rooms, which you've been getting pretty lucky here so far. Like the generators on the far left, the bottom left, and stuff like that. That's that's when it'll get you. That's when the game will get you. That's when it when it goes a little crazy. Okay. See, I like when they they pop in the close rooms, but not when you were out getting a big one. Nah, I mean, I feel like I'm repeating myself because I'm nervous. Still got like two minutes left. 88. We're at 88. We're at 88. That's fine. That's fine. We just gotta get this one. Pair. It's probably gonna bump down to 88 again before I get back. Yes, okay. Uh, bottom, okay. This is when we're gonna lose it. 
because it's taking a lot of time. Please stay at 80. Okay, okay, 99, 88 again. Oh, we got lucky. We got a drive by. We got lucky with the drive by. Cool, so we're all good still. That's awesome. Keep it coming. Let's keep going. I don't keep the coming. Don't keep it coming. I don't want to keep having to repair generators, but. You know. You know what I mean. I don't I don't want to lose the game. I want to, I want to do solid. I want to do good work here. Got to go all the way over here. Alright, repair this guy. So when they need repairing, does the light come on? Or is the light... Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Alright, we got to go all the way down this way. All the way down. This is the killer. Uh, okay, 77. So we got to like do some drive-bys. Do some drive-bys. Hope we get... I hope we get lucky. Directly underneath us. Okay. Please don't go out. Okay, we good. 88. Directly to the right. Okay, let's go fast. Fast, fast, fast. Gotta keep it going. Alright. Alright! That's what I'm talking about. Okay, all the way to the left. Whew. Keep it coming. Keep it coming. Keep it coming. Don't, don't die. Don't, don't, don't die. Don't, don't die. Don't, don't, don't die. Keep the generators on. 99% still, yo. 88%, okay. It's the right, directly to the right. It's fine. What's cool is I don't think it gets more intense as you go. Like, the, the later it is, <sighs> the closer you are to winning, I don't think it gets harder. Uh-oh. Gotta go fast. <laughs> don't don't slip now. Uh, yep, I don't think it gets... I don't think it gets more intense. I think it's just totally random which generators go down, and if you get them on opposite sides of the bunker, then that's more of a chance that you're going to lose. It's just more of a chance that generators are going to go completely out before you have a chance to do anything. Kind of like, like, these two rooms are definitely killer rooms. I survived. Congratulations, you survived long enough and with 12% power left. It said 13, but it changed to 12. 11. <laughs> this game's created 72 hours. Okay. All right, cool. So the percentage is still going down, but it's okay because the game's over. That was Miss Eyesore. That was pretty cool. It was pretty difficult. And I'd hate to see the version 1.0, like how difficult that, that version is because it, it, this was pretty hard within itself. But um, like I said, the version 1.1, which is this version, fixed some bugs. It definitely fixed optimization because it added in the... Um, you can uh, turn down the this, uh, the graphic settings, which mine are on the lowest, and I still drop frames, but this game is just so good, I had to play it. It's awesome. Very awesome. I loved it. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did enjoy, make sure you slap that like button underneath the video, and until next time, I'll see you guys later. Don't look at me! That's what I thought.